Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we are working on the race car again. All right, I already got the motor up in the air and we are going to be uh, putting the transmission on the, on the motor. I got this clutch. Uh, I ordered it through IS Performance. It's actually the stage four competition clutch. Good to about 500, I believe. So what I really like about it is that it's so thick. Like here's the flywheel and um, just everything about the pressure plate, the, just the thickness is so much bigger, the mass is so much bigger and just stronger than the, the stock clutch I had in it. Um, so it should be perfect. And once again, if you're needing any of these parts, stuff like that, go to IS Performance. You can find them on Facebook or Instagram. I tag them in most of my stuff uh, on Instagram, but that's how I ordered it through. Uh, great pricing, so they got that for me. But here's a uh, transmission. I got it all cleaned up. So with that kit, it comes with a new um, pilot bushing, which I already put in there. Throw out bearing. Um, so I got that cleaned up, greased a little bit, not too much. So we're gonna be going ahead and put stabbing the transmission on there, and then. Da, 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 da. we are going to be putting the motor in the car so i'm super excited about that um and one of the deals that i had to uh, kind of come up with would be the uh, motor mount situation so i already have aluminum transmission mount which i'll show you right here so this mount I made that basically goes to the subframe I've, I've shown you in a previous video. So to match up with that, what we're going to be uh, running, which I just machined these, are these aluminum blocks up here. So it will be a rigid mount set up, so that'll go in the factory uh, location there, and it'll just be aluminum. So I just went ahead and made these out of aluminum, and I'm, I'm super excited to run them. So. So that's it. We're going to get this together and I'll kind of time lapse it for you because it is a lengthy process and we're going to get it put in the car. So thank you for watching. All right, so we got the transmission put on with all the bolts torqued, and then I had to put on a motor mount, so did that on that side. Everything is put together, so we're gonna start moving it out and um, getting ready to put it in the car. This is my sister-in-law. It's not focusing. There we go. Yeah, she's got an awesome Speed Hunters jacket. She's pretty cool. This is Amanda, the wifey, with great hair. A smile for a while, long walks on the beach. Oh, oh, stylish. So I got the car inside and then what I had been waiting to do that I haven't done yet is I had to get the battery tray out so we had to drill through and, and some of it kind of peeled up but got the battery tray out with all of these spot welds. So eventually uh, when I get the motor in, I'm gonna go ahead and cut this out right here and then put a panel in after I get the intercooler piping to where it fits perfect. But eventually all this will get cut out with the tube front, but I wanna do that after the motor is running. Um, so all this is ready to go. I'm gonna get it lifted up and we can go ahead and try to stab the motor. So I kind of got carried away and uh, test fitting some parts and making sure everything will come together and work. 
um, after I got the motor put in. So sorry I did not film it, but I will give y'all an update right now kind of where I'm at. All right, so this is where the motor is right now. Um, got the Hoon Performance motor in the car. The intake is just sitting on there along with the exhaust manifold just to test fit all the pieces, make sure I don't have any clearance issues. The main deal right now that I was finagling with for quite some time is the oil drain line that comes off into the bottom of the turbo. Very tight, but it actually, uh, I got it to work out, so um, that's looking good. I just have this radiator sitting in here, uh, but most of the parts like the, the turbo manifold, uh, this radiator, and a um, couple other pieces here. Uh, which I'll be pointing out to you the clutch for sure I got from IS Performance so make sure you check them out as well there's gonna be a link below along with whom performances link as well and he builds amazing motors and I'm just so happy with it but this is where the car is it just gave me a bunch of motivation I got my intercooler down here with the piping I was kinda of mapping it out um, I did get the battery tray out so it is kind of a little beat up here but we're gonna end up cutting a hole there then a bigger hole on this side to run it all up but as far as it goes it's looking amazing I'm super excited all right so I want to give a huge shout out to Austin who is my brother he was helping me all day uh, he came specifically to help me put it, the motor in and do all that raising and lowering the motor adjusting it he did absolutely amazing so I want to give a huge shout out to him so if you're watching this video make sure you like and and follow him on Instagram I'll leave his Instagram uh, name right here on the screen and then I'll put a couple pictures I'll show you real quick uh, his S14 that he's working on it's also a KT awesome car he has uh, molded uh, body panels and everything is just a really cool looking car so y'all saw his car it's an awesome build he is going through every entity of the car redoing it modifying it to the way he wants he just got done with the wiring and that is something he's not familiar with and what I like so much about it is that with each step of the car he's using it as something to build himself to push his boundaries and it's just awesome it's cool that that um it's a good example of what a car should be to something you should push your boundaries and to continue on and grow with the car as the car changes and grows. So definitely give him a follow and uh, like all of his pictures, everything like that. He did amazing help uh, for me today. I'm just so excited to uh, be able to experience this with him because he is my brother and it was just really cool having him here, putting the motor in, something I've been wanting to do for about two to three years. So it's just super exciting. Thank y'all for watching this video. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to follow if you haven't. And if you have, you're awesome. Thank you so much, and I appreciate it.